Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. A very good day to all of you out there. In this video tutorial, I'm I'm going to share a way of how you can insert an audio file in your, for example, your intro uh, slide uh, using Google Slide and Pixabay. Right, so in here, I have my slide that I actually created maybe around last year uh, for a workshop uh, in USM, an online workshop in USM. So in here, I'm going to uh, insert my audio, but first, the source of the audio has got to be usually royalty free and also and also wouldn't get a copyright strike in YouTube if I want to upload this to YouTube. All right, so how do I do this? Um, let's go to Pixabay. I know Pixabay, um, we use it a lot. I use it a lot actually. Uh, there are many wonderful images, uh, some videos as well. You can use for free and also for commercial use. The one that I just saw today is music and sound effects. Let's just take a look on this one. Click on music. So this thousands of music is actually for commercial use and for non-commercial use. And you can see from here, you can choose, you have different categories. Um, you can also straight away jump into, you know, vlog, for example, podcast music, film music. I am going to look at, um, let's see here, I'm looking for, you can also look for energetic. So some keywords, especially if you're doing a tutorial video, uh, the one I tend to use, um, the keywords I tend to use are energetic, uh, bright sometimes, could be helpful, uplifting. Yeah. Uh, the rest are okay. You can go for that. Um, Epic would be good for vlog, especially travel vlog when you want to show the landscape. Yeah. All right. So let's go to uplifting. And here there are a number of it that you can go to. Yeah. Just just listen to it and see whether you like it. Okay. Inspiring also is a good keyword. Okay, let's say I'm going to use one of these. I'm going to show you how you can then up, up, uh, download and check whether it's actually going to be okay for YouTube. So first, just click download. And what they want from you once you're going to use it in your uh, YouTube video, for example, is that they want you to copy this and paste it on the slide or on the website and so on. So just uh, to make sure that you link back to the author, yeah, so that the author can gain something back that is usually the exposure. And I would also download the certificate, all right? So once I've done that, what I think you need to be clear of is about the copyright strike or the copyright notice. Um, you can check this one, I think, is available uh, in uh, Pixar, Pixar Bay uh, just now in the music section so you just need to read this through but the one i like to highlight here is that when you actually upload your video to youtube you might get a copyright strike yeah but it doesn't mean that uh, that your video cannot be uploaded what it means is that youtube wouldn't ban the channel or there's no no effect on the channel ranking at all yeah um the thing that you might not be able to do is that you won't be able to monetize the video. That's that's all the thing in a sense, yeah. Uh, so if you really want to monetize the video to make to make some money on YouTube, you need to contact the author of the music and request that they remove the claim. So that's that's basically it. So you still can upload your video, no problem, when you use the um, music that you have downloaded from. Uh, Pixabay, all right. Now, Pixabay, uh, not only they have um, they offer images, videos, illustration, um, you also offer music and also the sound effects. If you just go there up to the to the again to the icon, there's also sound effects that you can actually download here as well. Quite nice, you know. I so this is one one uh, way to uh, circumvent 
the premium version you may have to do a bit more searching and downloads and and you know create a collection of your music and also sound effects but at least they are actually quite quite free they're free basically you need to credit them uh that's that's all yeah all right so let's go to uh the uh google slide so here i just want to show you how you can insert an audio and just you know adjust it a bit for your video so here i have two audio files that i have uploaded to my google drive and it's, it's in my drive i just click on this one and i select it so it'll um the icon um the sound icon the speaker icon will actually um appear and on the you know on the right hand side i see immediately these uh, options and i can start playing on a click or automatically i'll choose automatically and the volume is um usually for my videos my youtube videos uh, with the background music even for my tutorials on skillshare uh, on udemy i would tend to reduce the sound just to about 20 down to maybe about uh, 5 to 20 uh, really the volume so uh, it's really up to you i mean uh, probably depends also on the um, uh, how loud is the music uh, so i usually keep it between about 15 around that yeah i would then hide icon when presenting all right uh, if it's a short audio of course you you want to um, loop an audio also it depends on whether your intro is going to be very very um, long or short i don't really uh, select that at all it's going to be a very short intro and then um yes and i also stop on slight change all right i think the rest is uh, okay let me just then play the slideshow so it's quite nice yeah all right, so with that, I thank you very much and I hope to see you in the next tutorial video.